Good morning. How are you guys doing? Marissa Myers here. I, like I've been sharing with you guys on my page, have no problem with getting my workout in. Although I did skip yesterday because my body was not feeling strong. I didn't feel like working out. So I listened to my body. I took the day off and that's not a problem. I know a lot of people who follow me think that I work out for like hours a day. People have even asked me, do I split my workout times up, like do once in the morning and the evening? If you're seeing a video of me in the morning working out and then you're seeing a video posted in the evening, it's because I, I pre-shot the video that's in the evening. So I shot it while I was working out and then I created it throughout the day and posted it for you guys at night. It's not that I'm working out twice a day. I literally only work out 22 minutes a day six days a week, and then two to three days a week, I add on 10 minutes of abs. So instead of 22 minutes, it's 32 minutes. Although yesterday I skipped, so I took the day off, and I'm gonna take an extra rest day this week. No problem. If you guys are hopping on here, say good morning, give me a thumbs up, a heart, say where you're watching from. If you have any questions, always feel free to ask, and I can address them at the end. But here's my uh, some moves of the day for those of you who wanna get a workout in, and I hope you enjoy. Uh, the first move, he calls them pump jumpers. So this is from my DVD workout. It's push-ups, but you're jacking your arms in and out. So you start with your arms narrow and your feet wide. And you do a push-up, and then you jack your arms out and your feet together and push-up. In, arms, out. So you're going opposite, okay? If you can't do it on your feet, which I think we did, we did three sets, so if you want to actually follow the routine, do three sets, start with 25, then go down to 20, and then go down to 15. But you do a set of them, and then you go into the next move, and you complete the full round. So you do, 20, you do 25, starting again with your hands narrow, your feet wide, push up, and then you switch. Push up, switch. So you do 25. Then you would go into the next move which was lunge thrust. I use, I use seven and a half pounds. These are fives, just so I can show you with a lighter weight. And just FYI, I was using fives all the way up until the seventh week of this program. So I did seven weeks with fives, and then I increased it to seven and a half the last two weeks, okay? Next, you're going to do thrust. So you alternate, lunge, thrust. Okay? I didn't show you modifications for the first one. If you want to modify those push-ups, come down to your knees and just alternate your arms in and out. If that's still too hard for you, just push up here. Just stay in a push-up position. Okay? Sorry, there's a thing going off in the screen. Okay, so that's move number one. Move number two was the lunge thrust. And we started with we started with 20, so you're going to do 20 of these, and then if you want, you can modify by putting down the weights and just doing it with your arms, or you could modify with keeping the weights in your hands, and you can simply start here and lunge back instead of jumping, okay? There's always a way to modify, so start with 20. And then in the next round, you'll do 25. In the final round, you'll do 30. All right, third move is plank row. I used 12 and a half um, for the entire program, but I'm just gonna use fives to show you. So you start in a plank position, um, shoulders, wrists, elbows in one straight line. You're gonna lift up and row. Two, three, four, Okay, the first round you do a set, and you can write this all down in a notebook so that you can actually do the workout later if you want to. So first set you do uh, 16, second set is 14, third set is 12. All right, um, for a modification, I mean, you could, I guess you could, I don't really know where, what the modification would be for that other than just holding a plank position and not using a weight. Just use your arms, okay? So you don't even need the weights. You can just do it like this. Yeah, that would be a modification. All right, next move is the, uh, I don't even remember what you call it, it's like mountain climbs or something like that. 
If you guys have questions, please feel free to ask and I'll answer them at the end. All right, so you hold the weight in one arm. I'm gonna hold it on the right side. Then you're going to come down to the floor. You're gonna put your hand down. So you're gonna squat down using your hand. You're gonna kick your legs out and your body out. And then you're gonna stand up. And actually in the, weight, in, the, in the video, they keep the weight here. So it's being pressed against your body. So it's a little bit easier. But me, of course I wanna make it harder. So I kept the weight off my shoulder and went down and kept my arm off the ground. So I'm having to hold it up. So it makes it a little harder. I used a 12 and a half, but right now these are fives. So you start with seven on your right. Then you do seven on your left. That counts as one, down. That counts as two, okay? And then the final move, so you, do, so you do seven in the first round on each side, then you do nine in the second round, and then you do 10, okay? Final move is, uh, I forget what he calls these, like uh, scissor clappers, I think, is what he calls these. So, we're gonna start here. We're gonna clap two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. And you start with a set of 50, then you go down to 40, and then you go down to 30, okay? And that's the complete workout for me. That's a 22 minute, 22 minutes long. Um, it's a hardcore workout. I'm gonna get in 10 minutes of abs, and then I'm gonna be done for the day. Do you guys have any questions for me? I'd be happy to answer them before I hop off here and get my ab workout in. Nope. Nobody's getting on. All right, I'll finish this up. Bye. See you guys later.